Hey guys, uh, welcome back to my channel. So today I have this package from Amazon, obviously. I had a company reach out to me through email. They said that they had seen my, my YouTube channel and they wanted to know if I would do an Amazon review for them in it, you know, so they would, they would send me money through PayPal and then um, I would order the product that they wanted me to open up and then they wanted me to leave an Amazon review. But since they see my channel, they subscribed, I thought I'd just quickly do a video on this. So, I'm sure you've probably already seen a couple people open the same bundle. So I'll just do it quickly. If you have any questions on anything, just leave them in the comments or um, find me on Instagram and send me a message and I will answer any questions that you may have. So, okay, let me show you really quick the Amazon listing. So this is what the Amazon listing looks like. And the, sorry if that's making you dizzy. I was trying to find the list of items that's supposed to be included in here. Oh, read more. There we go. All right, so it says the package includes one LED light pad, a USB cable, a manual, a light pad stand, clips, diamond painting fixing tool, which is a straightener, tool bag, a storage box with the 28 grids, plastic trays, pens, tweezers, wax, labels and baggies okay so let's see if everything is in here so we got this really cool bag okay so you have this boat and just for reference i did bring my measuring thing so we can measure it so it's about i don't know 11 centimeters by seven and a half. So just for reference, 11 by seven and a half. Here's a, a standard green boat that you get. This is a standard white tray. These are both small. The bag, we got that. And this baggie we do, we have lots of wax. What do you guys do with all of this? <laughs> Seriously, what, what do you do with all of this? I, I'd like to know what to do with it. You got a straightener, that's cool. I don't have one of those. Plastic tweezers. I do not know what I'm going to do with those. So there's supposed to be 20 little baggies in here. You know, a lot of people call these like the cheap bags. And and they are. They're not anything fancy. But they do work for storage. It's not like you're getting into your storage all that often. So they work for storage. They also work if somebody that you know needs a certain color of, a, of drills. You can throw them in here, label it real quick, and send it off. I mean, they're, they're functional. They're not sturdy, but they're functional. They're fine. Here's a lot of labels. Those work really nicely also. Some pens. One, two, three, four, five pens. And you have the straightener. This is probably the only thing I'll... The straightener is probably the only thing I'll keep. I don't use these multi-placers. I like the four placer the thin four placer and then you have four binder clips and these are just the standard size they're not anything too big there you got four binder clips this i'm excited about i see everybody have these and i don't have any because i didn't want to spend the money on them because i just thought they were too little but now i have some that i can try and they are okay they're very small they're very very small Okay, so let's, whoop, sorry if that noise bugs you. So let's see, the top of each little container is about two centimeters by two and a half centimeters. And they are about two centimeters tall. So they're, they're pretty tiny. Uh, they, I'm sure if you have, you know, smaller painting with lots of colors or I've seen Rebecca at four kids at 147 use multiple little what do you call these <laughs> you know she uses multiple little spaces here for the same color so she has color number one and there's like you know so she'll one 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 and then do the next one and then and and that seems to work out for her so I'm gonna I'm excited to try those out here's the 
stand and I've seen Crashly and Maritza struggle with this and I even after watching them struggle I'm sure I'm still gonna struggle okay so does this go in or out I think it goes this way okay yeah so you push it up this way and then it's got five different height adjustments so then that's how it goes and then you lay it here so look put that to the side for now so here's your USB cable that it comes with Unroll that. Cool. It's pretty long. Yeah, it's 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 a good length. Does the listing say how long it is? It says 1.5 m, and that doesn't mean very much to me. So if you know how long that is, it's it's fairly long. And then here is the light pad and it, it all comes really well packaged. There's this extra piece of cardboard here to stabilize the actual light pad. Then it comes protected in this sort of, I don't know what you would call that. It's kind of like a th really thin foam. Here's the manual, it comes inside there. These are soft little pads here. They're not grippy at all. They're just soft little pads. And here's that. Oh, this is so cute. Okay, so let's, just for reference, this is an A4 light pad, but just for reference, it's about 34 centimeters by 25. And that's edge to edge, Not that's not the white part here. The white part is about 31 by a little over 22 centimeters so this does not this just comes with the with the USB cord so you can plug it into your computer or if you have a I'm sure you do a lot of us do have this extra little converter here to be able to plug it into the wall uh, you'll just need one of those so you just plug that in and then we'll plug it into the wall and then here Okay, you, this is super thin. All right, so make sure that's plugged in all the way. And then you turn it on and that is very, very bright. Very, very bright. And then for this to adjust the light setting here, you'll just hold down the button. Oh, that just got brighter. So then you hold it down again and then it'll dim down, push, dim, get brighter. So let's, and then to turn it off, you just tap it. To turn it on, you tap it. Turn it off, you tap it. Here's the little thing. And I mean, it's it's fine if, you, if you're not too heavy handed. If you're not resting your arm or your hand on this, it's fine. If you're just lightly, you know, dipping into your wax and then placing, doing this action, it's, it's really nice for that. But it will not, I don't think it'll last very long if you're re actually resting your arm on that. So anyway, that's that's this bundle. I will list the, I will list the listing <laughs> down in the description box below. Um, yeah, if you have any questions, again, let me know in the comments or find me on Instagram, send me a message, whatever you want. And yeah, thanks for watching guys. Have fun diamond painting. Bye.